Good morning and happy Valentine's Day. So Valentine's Day is a fun day to celebrate. Um, things were probably a little bit different at school for um, parties or maybe you weren't at school. Well, no one's at school today on Valentine's Day, but we celebrated beforehand. And so I got a Valentine from one of my kiddos and it says, happy Valentine's Day. You're fantastic. Oh, isn't that cute? A little panda bear. And um, Finley got one that says, talk about taco about awesome. It has a taco on it. Fun, right? Here's another one. It says, you are just right. W-R-I-T-E. And a cute little pencil. Isn't that fun? Let's see. There's another cute one in here. Oh, this one has a whale. To a whaley special valentine. Isn't that fun? Well, what would happen if Jesus or God sent us a valentine? What do you think that would look like? I thought maybe it would look like this. Maybe he'd send us bubbles and it would say, let my love bubble over, Jesus. Maybe on the back he would write us a scripture from 1 Thessalonians 3.12. May the Lord make your love increase and overflow for each other and for everyone else. That would be sweet, wouldn't it? Oh, thanks, God. I like that. Maybe, uh uh-oh, maybe he would send us a ring pop. Everyone loves a ring pop, right? And maybe it would say, you're more precious than rubies, right? Psalms 31.10. Or maybe a cozy teddy bear that says, I love you very much. And then maybe he would give us scripture from Ephesians 2, 4, and 5. But God, because of his great love for each of us, made us alive together with Christ. That would be sweet, wouldn't it? But what if we just got this valentine from Jesus, or from God, and it says, be mine. What does that mean? Maybe on the back he would write Matthew twenty-two thirty-seven: Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. You see, boys and girls, we make Valentine's Day about all these things, and it's so fun to get fun gifts and candies and chocolates and cards. But love is something that was given to us first by God. That's why we know how to love, because God loves us. And what God simply wants back from us is for, him, for us to love him with all of our hearts, with all of our minds, with all of our strength. He wants us to serve him and to serve others, and there's so many ways that we can show love. But see, the awesome thing is, is that if we're God's, if we give him our heart, he will bless us with so much love, so many gifts that are better than any of these things that I brought today. But he just wants to love us more and more each day. But the thing that we have to do is be his, give our heart to him. So my prayer today is that if you haven't given your heart to God, that you would, that you would be God's. Let's pray. Father God, We thank you so much that you pursue us, that you ask us every single day to be yours, that your love is more than we could ever, ever understand, but it's forever and ever. I just pray that we would follow you, that we would love you with all of our hearts, our minds, our strengths, and our soul, and that we would see the blessings and the gifts each day that you give us because of the love that you have for us. In Jesus' name, amen. God, may your love bubble over. I like that.